Hello again folks and welcome back to Let's Play Ghost Hunter. I'm your host the Game of Darius. Last we left off, uh, there was a military slash cruise ship? I'm sorry, I've never really imagined those giant military ships with the whole banquet sort of situation going on. Also, uh, there was a Kraken. That's, that's honestly about as much as I currently rem remember, as it's actually been a while since I last recorded this. I apologize. I also don't remember my only having... 17 health, so this is bound to be a bad time. Okay, oh hey, that's right. Little bit of health from you. And yes, I saw that note on the ground. Working on it. Ah, yes, the titular notebook. Uh, on some sort of prison island. That can only bode well. Welcome to the official guided tour of Devil's Scar Penitentiary, the world's most infamous island. We promise you a fun day out discovering the truth behind the legends, and if you behave, we'll even allow you to do what all those inmates dreamed of, to leave the island with a glass of champagne thrown in. Well, that's nice of you. Sit in Old Smokey, the Nash nation's most prolific electric chair. See the cell in which housed Frank Anglin found out how... Find out how the deadly riots were sparked in 53. Listen to the voice of Warden McCarthy and then come and then comes your own chance to turn the lights out, losers. And of course, you'll explore the mystery of the century. Did Joey Houdini Holbrook actually escape? Find or follow in his footsteps and find out for yourselves. The Devil Scar Ghosts, a scroll, stroll down death row in Frank Eglin's flame grilled burger bar. <laughs> All I had, and guess what? There's no escape. I mean, it kind of lost me at the hook of all exploring all the cells of the convicts and whatnot, but it got me at the flame grilled burger bar. Won't even lie, I would totally go to some sort of destination like this just because of a burger bar. I've had far more zany road trips based off of a sim similar premise. Hey buddies, let's go watch, let's go find out uh, how bad that Yu-Gi-Oh! 3D movie really is. Honestly, that Yu-Gi-Oh! movie was not that bad. Yeah, I'm getting the hang of this again. Where am I? Oh wait. Ah, bastard. Ran away. Like a punk. Uh, I'm trying to remember what but Oh yeah, that's right. Whoa, whoa. Did not know I would be still fighting gunmen? I'm gonna go with gunmen. Whoa, hi. Ah. Come on. Yeah. Yes. Feeling good about that. Is anyone else still firing at me? Yeah, people are still firing at me. Oh, a sniper. Sniper's nest. That's no bueno. Uh, what one was the sniping but Ah, screw it. Come on. Stop headbanging up there. Thank you. Uh, let's go ahead and heal trusty. I I got multiple colors for this thing. <laughs> Anyways. I'm gonna keep it to the stars, because I like the stars. They're pretty. Okay, I thought for a second that was going to be a outhouse situation. I'm kind of glad it was not. Hmm. Yeah, not gonna lie. Not exactly sure why the hell away was trans transported here of all places. What the what the hell kind of ghosts would I 
I suddenly remembered a bunch of shit from Vampire or Hunter the Reckoning. And uh I'd rather not be in a ghostly facility. Hmm. Oh, I missed the door. Ew. I'm, I'm gonna just hope that the people behind this aren't purely catching sharks for shark fin soup. That shit's inhumane. At least use the rest of the shark, you know? Just toss him back out into the water to meet a non-swimmable demise. Okay, I'm turning that out. Hello? Oh, I can now confirm there simply was no escape. Yes, that's right. Get that in your headline. No escape. Prisoner tried his luck, but as I've said a hundred times, it can't be done. The only way those boys will get off this island is in a box. Holbrook went into the furnace, and that's as far as he got. Burnt to a crisp. No doubt about it. Uh, can you prove that, Warden? Hell no. There's enough ashes in there, you'd be sifting forever and never find a thing. But that's where he is. Good riddance, I say, because that was his choice. Uh, is it true you've clamped down on all the prisoners, Warden? Made your regime even harsher? Uh, are you still in control when they're... You better believe it. Well, none of those boys were sentenced to a picnic now, were they? They've done what they've done, and your readers can rely on me to make them pay. That's what my institution is all about. Now, if you'll please... What would you say to our readers who, frankly, may not be convinced by your explanation, Warden? Many will surely assume that you failed, that Eugene Holbrook has got the better of you, and that he's out there at large. That will be your last ever question to be sunny. What I say to your readers is this. It can't be done. I mean, even if he did get to the water, which he didn't, he'd either be drowned or sharkly. No one has ever escaped and lived to tell the tale. The day someone does will be the day I die. Hmm. I'm wondering if he ate his own words. Or if a shark ate him for him. For his words, I don't know. Hello? I don't... No, I didn't come around here already. And this is honestly the part of these kind of games I really do like, where you're picking up lore and whatnot. Oh boy. History was made yesterday. The impossible achieved. An inmate escaped from Devil Scars Island. A penitentiary which houses the nation's most dangerous criminals, mostly awaiting execution, was believed to be so secure that escape was impossible. No prisoner has ever been released from Devil's Island, let alone escaped. But yesterday, all that changed when the Fire Nation attacked. The prison authorities have confirmed that the inmate in question is Joey Houdini Holbrook, sent to Devil Scar as a last resort following his daring breakouts from other institutions. His reputation for being able to get away from any jail earned him his nickname, and his transfer to Devil Scar has been seen as a personal challenge to Warden McCarthy, renowned for his prison's tough regime and un unblemished rec record. Blech. Warden McCarthy has been unavailable for comments since the incident. Holbrook's plan was simple yet bold. Daily Pacific understands that Holbrook faked illness and was taken to the hospital wing in order to recuperate. After dark, he left his bed and broke into the furnace room. From here, he made his way through the s sewer system, emerging on the south beach by the old church where he is assumed to have swum to safety. I mean, it's a pretty good assumption, honestly. Like, sharks attack you, as far as I recall from what I've learned. Sharks only attack human in the water because they think they're seals, and usually that's only if they're on a surfboard of some sort. And even then, only if they're hungry? So it's not exactly just that common of occurrence. Shark attacks are not that often. Despite what Jaws has told you. A good more ammo that I didn't need. Hello? 
Oh, I'm on the other side of that wall. Glorious. Any more snipers? And there's gonna be a couple of them. So far, I'm actually kind of enjoying this level. I don't know what it is about penitentiary levels and modern video games. They're spooky, but they're right kind of spooky. Hmm. That guy coming at me. If I move over here. Whoop, oh, yep. Pium. Oh yeah, that feels good. Whoa, has the possession ability. <clears throat> okay. Oh, don't actually know who these guys are. Pretty sure I'm actually capturing the bad, good guys. Oh, crap. Yeah, I don't know what's with these guys' outfits. Oh, but there's another one over here. Oh, another two over here. Nah. Where are you, guy? I saw ya. Whoa. He sees me. Oh, hey. Ow. I could have better aim. Don't know why you ask. Can I even get to that one? Man, I do like the music around here though. Maybe I'm also just enjoying the ambiance of the rain. Hmm, rain. I live in Southern California. I don't get much rain. This feels like a shark based trap. Maybe it was. Maybe I outwitted the shark. And we're gonna leave that healing right there. Okay, just had to make sure that there wasn't any other things. Hello. Spectral lasso. Runs off ghost energy, drains ghost energy from afar. Okay. Tis a lasso of some sorts. Lasso. Lasso? I've heard it pronounced lasso as well, so. Potato, potato, tomato, tomato. Oh, no, not the. Oh, wait. I can't escape through the sewers. I only wonder what side of the island this is now. Alright, first off, how does this thing work? Uh, kind of like a flamethrower by the look of it. <clears throat> How was the crouch button again? There we go, down. Hello, sir. Fine. Okay. Ooh, that's actually really good. As such, I'll try to only use it for boss fights. Clamber. Oh, no. I'm beyond waist high in poop. It's a sewer. It's poop. Okay, you know what? I honestly don't want to be just messing around with these guys. I'm Mr. Revenant. Do I... Okay. Try this again.
You know, that looks a lot smoother when I actually get a chance to look at it and it doesn't slow down the game. <coughs> Just saying. Excuse me for my morning bodily noises such as coughing and sniffling. So, I'm only presuming that I'm supposed to capture these guys. Right? I am doing a good, right? Seems like I'd be doing a good catching revenants. They're not exactly a a good to just leave lingering around. Especially in an area like this where they can move unhindered, but I'd be royally screwed up the butt. Look at this. Some good waddling skill right there. Gotta hope I'm not going the wrong way. I must not be anymore. Does this just go around in a circle? I'm willing to figure this out. Uh, poo water. Dead end. Another revenant. Throw me a freaking bone here. Probably a dead end. Or, this is some actually part of a puzzle and I gotta drain this bitch. Or it's a dead end. Good instinct, Dar. Eh. Eh. Uh. <clears throat> Still. Digging this spectral flamethrower, that's for sure. Probably not gonna be all that useful at range, of course. But still. It's definitely useful. Doesn't spawn him behind me, is there? I swear we'll move at a normal pace eventually. God, I don't think I waded through the water at that much of a pace in the first level. That's saying something. Hello? That made, made me jump a little bit, I ain't gonna lie. <clears throat> I... Why are you giving me health? Barely fought anything so far. Oh, I'm gonna hate this. Alright. What was... Sniper scope button? Scope. No. No. Go. Yeah, no, I ain't even gonna bother with that. Oh, I got Hmm. Kind of already seen what I have to do. I kind of already hate it. Puzzles. Wonder if I ought to deal with uh, what's his face over there first. I gotta raise the water level at some point. Yeah. Yeah, there's an astral point over there. For one, I saw it. For two, I can hear it. Oh. You guys have some weird, interesting uniforms, you know that? Eh. 
slowly turn around. Nope, over there. Come on. Give me your soul. That wasn't such a chore. All right. Now to just phase through the bars, we can start solving puzzles. Or I guess we could... Mm. Oh, hey. Yeah, I'm trying to put you in this entire island to rest. Chill out. Alright. Okay, didn't see that there was going to be another Spectre guy. Ow. 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 Okay, buddy. Wait, what? I'm going to be eternally confused about which waste high water I can and cannot, in fact, shoot stuff in. But hey, at least we can now access the... yeah. Oh. Okay. I have to get into the dark heart of this miserable place. It fills me with despair. Kay has turned the guards' powers upon themselves. Sneaking up behind, she possessed one down on the docks, allowing us access through. Well, that would have been good to know, I guess. So I guess we're going to be possessing a dude down at the docks. As soon as I know which way that is. Still, at least now we got a nice relaxing bit of this. I mean, this music isn't exactly relaxing, but I digress. Alright, try to find those docks. Possession, eh? Why were we given possession? Oh, I gotta go up. Yeah, when we were given possession from a guard. I don't know, seems like a odd choice of power combinations if you ask me. Hi. Can I possess you? Uh this one, right? Yes. All right. Okay. Uh, how do we get out of his thing again? There we go. Okay, now that that's done, now what? I got a feeling I don't go through there, seeing as that's where that little mine cart came out of. Uh, do I have to do something to this? Poltergeist. No. Revenant. Actually, you know what? It's probably a safe assumption to just go, okay, maybe, uh, maybe I return now. Oh, that's right, I have a spectral vision. Maybe it's a glitch. Maybe I'm not supposed to actually see that cart full of boulders, cart full of rocks. That's, that's my theory, anyhow.
Because I gotta go up somehow from here. Oh! The thing I have to hit isn't there. Because it's like... It'll pop out at one of those. Go round and around. Kind of feel a little stupid for craning my own head there for a second, but all right. Okay, so how's it do that? Hmm. Let's, show, let's go back to being spectral for a second. Because now I'm intrigued. I mean, I've been intrigued, but curious. Ah, being spectral ends up using a lot of my uh, spectral ammo. But then again, this mission hasn't exactly been all that bad when it came when it comes to ammo so far, so... I guess I can't complain? Let's see, it's supposed to go around... through there? I'm kind of confused as to what the hell this is supposed to be doing anyhow. Unless there's multiples of these guys I'm supposed to possess. Uh, stop snoozing on the job. We got more possession to do. You know, possess. Possess. Drill. Drill. More drilling? I don't know how much I'm supposed to be drilling here. It's clearly giving me time to do something. But once I drill, maybe I gotta unpossess. No, I can't unpossess the guy while he's still drilling. Maybe I could drill at a different point. I'm very confused. Why am I drilling stuff? I don't know. But I do know that I need to... in some creatures for some spectral energy. Hold still, rat. All right, buddy. For the greater good. The greater good. No, I don't doubt that I would have been done with this game by now if I had an inkling of what I was actually supposed to do. Just saying. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and call an episode here. When we return, we got to figure out what the hell this puzzle is. So, yeah, I don't even have a small iota of what the hell I'm supposed to do. I'm just going to try to do it. So thank you all so very much for watching. I hope you guys... Yeah, okay. <laughs> wow, completely ruined my outro. I hope you guys are enjoying watching this series as much as I am enjoying playing it again. 
As always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Cheers.